All right, guys, I bought some key merch from uh, Otaku Mode website, tokyootakumode.com. And uh, for, if you don't know what this is, it's some um, a bunch of stuff to celebrate the 20th anniversary of Key Studios, something like that. Key is the guys who did, um, let's see, they did Clanad, they did Little Busters, they did uh, Angel Beats, re re Rewrite, yeah, Air, Canon, and uh, all of them. I'm sure I'm forgetting a few, but yeah, their 20th anniversary. They got a bunch of special exclusive merch to buy. Um, I got a fair amount. I got two of these and two of these. They're different sets. So these are the, I think they're called record coasters or something. I'll uh, open these first. But in summary, they're, all these are blind bags, obviously, but they have different um, sets. So I think I bought one Angel Beat set and one Clan Ad set of each of these. I don't really remember because I pre-ordered this kind of a while ago. Um, bought this in maybe October, September, September, maybe it was Black Friday. It might've been recent. Anyway, I'm just gonna go into this. Don't know what to expect. These are the record coasters, something like that. Let's see what it looks like. And what do we get? Okay, so this is Air. It's kind of cool. It looks like a CD, if you can tell. Comes in like a little fake sleeve and everything, like a real CD sleeve. The inside is just a coaster, plastic. Can you feel that? Can you hear that? Can I get the vibe of the plastic it is? And it looks like a record, which is pretty cool. Um, this one is Air. Side A, original side. I don't really know Air, to be honest. But, uh, yeah. She might be the protagonist, I don't know, or the heroine. And uh, it looks nice. It's not. It doesn't feel like a cheap plastic sticker. It feels kind of more professionally on there. They can't pick it off, which is nice. It's a coaster. Pretty sturdy. It does look like a record. You can see little ridges all over. It spins a bit. And comes a nice little sleeve again. Here's the back. Here's the front. Has little detailed words and all that. It's kind of weird that it's in English. I don't know if you can tell from the zoom in. But put it back in its little sleeve. It's kind of like you got a CD. This next one. Um, yeah, I'll open the second one. Again, these are, I don't remember the exact product names, but they're like record coasters or something. And this one is Little Busters. Cool. Okay. Um, yeah, as you can tell, the one I opened first said volume one. This one is volume two. So I guess I bought one of each. This one is Little Busters. Ecstasy, which is like the uh, enhanced version, I guess. Had more content, focus more, more on Saya, Haruka, and I forget her name. It's been a while, but uh, again, same C, slipcase kind of thing. I bet you, I mean, I'm, I assume this is what the actual CDs look like, the same track list, art, all that. It's nice. And the coaster itself, it's that same art right there. Looks good. Has a little key logo, a little less ecstasy. Same thick plasticky, obviously. It's three little feet to keep it from sliding around too much. And uh, I assume this is a waterproof since it's a coaster. I'd hope so. This one is actually a little off center. Can you tell? Yeah. So like, if you look at this one, sticker is right placed in the center. This is like even distance. But this one over here, pretty disappointing actually. It's very off center. Can you tell? It does feel like the sticker is a bit looser on this one. Ah, oh, that's disappointing. It's a shame because I like the Little Buster one better anyway. Oh, maybe I'll just be more careful with this one. Maybe I could complain and get a... No, it's not worth the effort. Yeah. Um, so beware, there might be a few factory errors among them inconsistencies, but they look nice, right? <laughs> Beautiful sleeves, I'll leave them like that for now. And these, up next are these. These are little art boards or something like that. I don't know if you can read Japanese, but this one's Angel Beats. This one is uh, Little Busters, yeah. They're kind of little, um, I don't know the word for it, art boards. It's kind of like a, 
canvas. Yeah, they're like canvases. There we go. So I'll just open it up to see. Just show you guys what I mean. They're definitely smaller than I expected them to be. I think on the photo, on the description it said they were like eight by three or, something, or like eight by five or something. I thought they meant inches, but maybe it was like centimeters. Pretty small. But uh, here's what it is. It smells like uh, hmm, has a weird smell to it. Um, this is a frame from the visual novel, Little Busters. See, it's like a can fake little canvasy thing. It's got the wood feels really cheap. Can you can you tell it's like that? Like a really cheap uh, chopstick tea, or um, or or like wooden plain wood, you know, like that cheap kind of board. Oh well, at least the canvas part's nice. This is um, I forget the name Masato or something. That's not Masato, and Rin. Pretty nice little scene, and it comes with a little standee. Standee is also made of the really cheap feeling wood model wood I don't know the word for it but it extends you can angle it goes on right on like this does it even go on like that okay you can't put it too far otherwise that's kind of dumb look the top interferes you get what I'm saying so like this is supposed to go here flush along that but when you put this out too much it sticks out so you can't even really like let me try it doesn't even really balance that well because this is knocking up against it. I think you have to find a way to put this little slot underneath this part of the frame. So it's right right now if I do this, it looks kind of nice, but it's not even hanging on the bottom. It's kind of just hanging off the top, like it's not touching the bottom, you see. So that's kind of disappointing. Um, I was kind of hoping these would be a bit better, fancier, nicer. I think they cost like almost $9 a piece, something like that. 800 yen each so beware of these products i would recommend them only if you're a key fan material kind of shoddy the qc quality control is uh seems a bit mediocre at best this one is uh, angel beats okay so this is iwasawa and um i forget her name is it chiharu it's been a really long time since i saw angel beats i must have seen that in like 2013 2012 during 13 but uh yeah that's nice this one i think might be a, might work a bit better since it's horizontal actually no it's the same problem i was gonna say if it's vertical it'd work fine but it's not it's horizontal so it's vertical you could just go like that and it'd be nice and flush and all that but uh i probably won't end up using these stands these stands are pretty junk but check them out they're nice little art it's like printed on paint. Sorry, it does feel like actual print on paint, not just a ink kind of thing. And uh, this is it. This is my little haul for 20th anniversary of Key. Congrats to you guys, Key or whoever's the writers, creators, whatever. June Maeda, all them. And uh, yeah, it's my little mini contribution to that to their fund because I appreciate their works. I could have sworn I bought a clan ad thing, but I guess not. Oh well. Little Busters, Angel Beats, clan ad, the three series I really like from them. Um, I have something else of theirs on the backlog. I think it was Planetarian or Canon or something. One of those. It's on the backlog. But, uh, yeah. If you want to check these out for yourselves, buy them. Um, I can put a link somewhere below. Not affiliated or anything. Just uh, spreading the word. I like seeing things before I buy it, and I don't know if it's a good product or not, if I should buy it. I think an overall summary, I'd say that they're not, these aren't really worth the price, to be honest. Like, this one, you saw there's a little defect, and that's one of two. And then these, pretty poor construction with this, and then it all feels pretty cheap. But if you like Key, if you want to buy it anyway, it looks nice, it looks cool. I really like the, everyone loves blind boxes, right? Blind bags. Um... Yeah, if you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. I can answer them best I can. I'll try to upload this as soon as I can, since I just got these in the mail very recently. I want it to be um, new, so you guys can actually buy it before it goes out of stock on their website. Yeah, um, take care, guys.
Again, any questions in the comments. See ya.